Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Alright guys, as you just saw from that snippet of the clip, I had a very big fish on, and um, I'm not going to talk too much, so I'm just going to give some backstory. So, right now I'm just walking in the woods because... It's a nice day outside. Just for reference, this is like two weeks after the original clip. I've been out making other videos, and um, this is basically just like raw GoPro footage. And um, it might be a little boring at the beginning because I'm just going to play like the backstory so you guys have an understanding. But if you skip through it, you're not really going to understand. So I would recommend watching the whole thing. It's only like two or three minutes. And um, yeah, basically we're just talking about how we're not catching anything. And um, the bite's slow since it's pretty cold outside. You'll see in the video, I'm not gonna spoil it too much, but a very large fish jumps and we couldn't make out what it was cause it was kinda like, we weren't really looking in the direction when it jumped, but we just saw a huge splash and heard it. But I'm not gonna talk too much and uh, I'm just basically gonna roll the um, GoPro clips right now and uh, I'll see you guys at the end of the video and I'll talk a little more. But for now, I'm just gonna show you guys what you came here to see and that is a probably the biggest fish I've ever had hooked up. So I'll see you guys at the end of the video. Dude, this, the Strike King rage bug is terrible. I'm never, I'm never buying these again. I first saw the video and they were like, dude, what was that? Does he have your line? What was that thing? Dude, that's huge. Did he go for it and miss? Tell you later. I, I, we literally gotta catch this thing. What is that? I didn't see it because I was looking at you. No, I was back. That was big. Did it sound big? I couldn't hear him. What did it? Did he hear the head shake? No way. That was a bass. Did you hear the head shake? Dude, don't spook him. He's over here. Whatever it is, it's probably not a bass. But if it is. You would have been able to hear the head shake though. You were like pretty close. Dude, that, I swear to God, I saw something. I couldn't tell if it was long or skinny or short and fat, but all I saw was something big. <gasps> oh, oh my God. <laughs> I got him. Dude, that was a, that was a muskie. That was a muskie. Oh, oh my God. Dude, that was the biggest fish I've ever seen in my life. Oh my God, dude. I literally screamed like a little girl. I swear on my life, that was a muskie. It was longer than my kayak. It took your ride in the Dude, oh my god. He, oh. Dude, I have no words how to describe myself right now. That was the biggest fish I've ever seen. Dude, you're like. Holy. Sh that was literally bigger than my rot. I swear to god, dude. I don't know if the GoPro could see that, dude. Dude, did you see that thing? I would have turned around all you. Oh my god. Did you see the tail? Oh my god. There's no way I would have landed that. That was a muskie. There's no way that was a northern. If that was a northern, that's a world record. I'm not even joking, you guys. I've never seen a muskie. I, I honestly don't know what I'm talking about when it comes to muskies and how big they are. But I swear to God, it was it was longer. Yeah, look, it's a clean break. So he literally. I just retied. I just retied. There's no fray in my line. Dude. I need to look at that. I need to look at that footage right now, dude. I'm shaking so much. Dude. If I would have caught that, that was literally, I'm not even joking, probably a 60, 60 inch putt, 60 inch musky. That's actually look good. That's, That's insane. Yeah. Dude, I need, I'm looking at that footage right now. Oh my God, I'm, I better have got that on camera. All right, so yeah, as you guys saw in the video, most likely that's probably the biggest fish I've ever hooked up so far. I've caught some like stingrays and stuff, but I don't think I've ever had a fish that big on. And yeah, I freaked out. Like, I really freaked out. And um, I kind of regret screaming like a little girl, but um, it's okay. Just my first reaction. <laughs> and if you guys saw in the clip, like I didn't really 
I was just like, oh my god. I was just like, I said, oh my god, really loud, because like I saw the fish. I wasn't scream, I wasn't screeching like a little girl because of the fish. I was screeching because my rod fell in the water. Because I set the hook with one hand because my other, my right hand slipped, which was on the reel, and I'm right hand dominant. So the, my left hand was holding all that weight, probably like a 50 pounds worth of fish, and. Once it, it, I don't know if you guys could see from the GoPro, but once it took off under the kayak, that's when I just lost it. And the reel just went right into the water. At first, I thought I was going to lose it, so I was like, oh my god. But yeah, um, a little cringy when I was screaming like that, but it's all good. I mean, there's no way I really could have caught it with the 20-pound fluorocarbon. And especially in like a cheap nine foot kayak so yeah thank you guys for watching this video wasn't like the most uh this video definitely wasn't the most planned video we were just gonna go try to catch fish and then afterwards um if we caught anything we would make a video out of it i didn't catch anything but it was a very exciting and scary moment at the same time so i just wanted to share that with you guys like i was hoping we would have at least caught little bass or at least something but um yeah we saw a fish jump and then we were like trying to catch it because we thought it was a bass or like a big northern but that was for sure not a northern because there, there's no way a northern would be that big but i have caught big northern and that was like twice the size of my pb northern which is like 32 inches but um yeah i'm gonna stop talking thank you guys so much for watching the next video should be a catfishing video um i just just filmed that like two days ago i was with my friends so be on the lookout for that that should be next video after i get done editing this i'll edit that and then in the in two videos from now i'm actually going hunting this weekend and that should be interesting so yeah some good videos planned in the next couple videos should be good so stay tuned to the channel and uh, mixing it up a little bit since i can't really go fishing until ice comes and the ice is just starting to freeze so like i can't really go ice fishing right now but yeah there's some fun videos planned it's still gonna stick to the two times a week upload until summer hits and then hopefully go like every other day or something like that but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this and yeah i'll see you guys in the next video where i'm hopefully catfishing